on stage welcoming you back is the Archbishop M.C. O'Neill Catholic High School Concert Choir. The choral program is huge as o at O'Neill, as you can tell by looking at the massive number of talented singers up here. This year marks O'Neill's 50th anniversary as a school, and the choral program has been going strong for over 30 of those years. For their spring concert, O'Neill will be featuring an alumni choir to help mark the occasion of the 50th anniversary. If there are any former Titans in the crowd interested in joining the Alumni Choir, feel free to join the Facebook page or inquire at the school. And for all Titan alumni, you can rest easy. After learning of this exciting opportunity, I had our IT staff block Principal Tracy Fuchs' access to that Facebook sign-up page. <laughs> Mr. Fuchs displayed incredibly diverse talents as a former Titan, but singing was not one of them. However, we do look forward to him bringing back his deadly mullet for the reunion tour. <laughs> and now, I'd like to invite a couple of current Titans to come to the podium and speak a bit more about their pieces. Good evening, my name is Caitlin Patrick. And I'm Nathan Gold. This is the last year for both of us in the O'Neill Choral Program, as we will be graduating in June. But the grade 12s represent only a portion of our immense choir. We have over 200 students, and there's plenty of oppor opportunities for us and the musicians. Aside from our concert choir, we also have vocal jazz groups that the students can audition for, and a rock band, and a praise and worship group. The beautiful piece you just heard is titled Still, Still, Still. The original version of this song is an Austrian Christmas carol and lullaby. It featured solos by Hannah Berry and Maria Noho. Our second selection tonight will showcase our senior choir, which is made up of grade 11s and 12 students. Rejoice is a gospel hymn composed by Jeffrey Ames, a music professor and choral director at Belmont University in Nashville. It is upbeat and celebratory and is sure to get you moving and clapping along. The solists for Rejoice are Bella Lugnassen and Johnny Sempeng. Enjoy. Let 
us exalt his name together. We are his people and the sheep of his pasture. Be thankful unto him and bless his name. We have four different vocal jazz groups. These small select choirs meet in the mornings and at lunch throughout the week to practice. Vocal jazz groups differ from concert choirs in that they are a much smaller group, they sing on microphones, and the style of singing is more conversational and sometimes improvised. One popular group that provides a lot of inspiration for our vocal jazz choirs is the group Pentatonics. This vocal group comes, came into the North American music scene in 2011 and is characterized by their own unique arrangement style, tight vocal harmonies, deep vocal bass lines, and plenty of vocal percussion and beatboxing. We hope you enjoy the Pentatonics version of Joy to the World sung by our three combined senior vocal jazz groups, featuring beatboxing by Johnny Sempeng.
final piece tonight is Christmas Kumbaya, and we will again get our full concert choir back together. Most of you will recognize parts of this song, as Kumbaya is a very traditional and familiar hymn. This arranger, Jay Althouse, has combined Kumbaya with African words and rhythms for a truly unique and uplifting song. This one has been a favorite of our choir to practice. Hopefully the singers will move along to the music as much as they have been doing during our rehearsals. It's hard not to get into the spirit and move along to, the, to this piece. We hope that you enjoyed it as much as we do. As they exit the stage, join me another round of applause for the O'Neill Choral Concert Choir. 